kids tend to, nowadays they don't talk to people. They don't go out with their friends. Um, they'd rather watch YouTube. They worry about the kids because they aren't belonging to a community and that's really impacting their health. It's 24 seven for these kids. They're on social media, they, they get bullied all day. That's why we need organizations like Second Wind. In 2000, um, there was a big problem at one of the high schools here in town and several kids committed suicide. So this group of parents um, created a fundraiser, a, a 5K walk run, raised money, and then started doing mental health services. And it's become a bigger organization and, and now it's a nonprofit. And I see how it values the kids and, and impacts their lives directly. They've actually helped 7,000 kids get therapy and mental health services and then help parents find resources. But there's many opportunities to be involved in, in your community and many great resources to help you find that. I think it's really important that you give back. We have so much and are so fortunate. Um, and we need to give that back. We need to share that, that our community can grow and become better. Um, there's no limit to what you can see in your community or what you can do. Through our communities and working with our communities, we are limitless.